So I really do like it when people use my creations in their creations. Um, so I'll be highlighting people that do that. Um, and this one's Siren Head. And it's like, holy crap, I know I love Silent Hill anyway, but I've heard about Siren Head, but let's see what this is. Send me your creations also that you make, guys, if you guys want them on my channel. You are telling me I'm going to investigate work on any case for missing persons. This is uh, already the dopest thing in the world. Your findings have led you to an abandoned campsite where reports of struggling sounds. What you find will challenge you forever. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is actually really well done. This is this looks like something I would do. <laughs> I wish I could run. That's about it. But yeah, this is really well done. Um, we're, the, the, we're, I, I know there was an objective that said, well, I guess there is one. It said the challenge will challenge me forever. I don't know, but here's the real objective. We have to find my VCR. That's the real objective. We're gonna, I, I bet it's in there. I, I, it's gonna be next, what is that? It's gonna be next to a TV. Inside of here, oh, I think there's two cabins, so there might be two VCRs. It might have had a brother. I, I know, I know. I have three. I have the latest com commentary. I know. Text. Why don't Why don't you do more of this? You're making a game. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so yeah, I upload tutorials and I also upload this stuff. Um, I really like Siren Head. Siren head, this is the one. <laughs> whoa, 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 jump scare. What just happened? I, I thought the other one would be the one. Mm, there he is. That has to be my thing. It is. We found him. His name is George. His name is George. We found my creation, guys. Oh my gosh. We did it. Now we gotta find Siren Head. Whoa. Where's Siren Head? What is this? Is this like a loading screen? Pennywise. The handle won't turn. This is supposed to be the one, not that one. I was completely wrong. Like, like I thought, uh, I thought, I thought for sure the horror cliches would be followed. But I was wrong. Siren head. Nice little flag there. Fire is still burning. Someone must be here. Yeah, it's siren head. We're gonna walk in the fire. Ah, oh, you made the barrier. Most people wouldn't do that. Oh, wait, no, no, you didn't make the barrier. You keep tricking me. Whoever created this keeps on tricking me. You need to make it to where you can run. It's like, cause, cause I have like, I have an amazing attention span, right? but only when the run button's actually there. You know what I'm saying? Like if the run button was here, I, I wouldn't, I'd be all like, yay. And then we'd be probably playing this for like 20 hours. But since there's no run button, I, I'm like, whoa. You know, I might actually make a level like this for Polybius. Like I might, like this is, this is the kind of thing I was trying to do anyway. But for whatever reason, I, I haven't like done it. Well, I guess I did do it already. What am I talking about? There are cabins in my in my level. What, what the heck am I talking about? It, this just looks uh, this just looks like you know Jason. You know what I'm saying? It, mine doesn't like you know look like Jason. It looks more like um, Fallout or something. This right here just okay. So I'm guessing this is one of those slender moments where I can like backtrack. If I can't figure out what to do, this is the video, and that's it. Be happy. Oh yeah, you gotta press the button to enter the door. Yeah, 
there needs to be either a note or a button indicator that tells me that this is how you open doors. I'm pretty sure you, I just had to turn on the TV the whole time. It has to be a siren head. Siren head. Okay, so we did it. A, a key. This game's getting dope. This game is dope. Dreams is dope, dude. Okay, so this is a busted doorknob. So the key opens this or opens that. Let's see if he tricks me again. Yay! Siren head. I'm gonna actually look up some siren head videos after this video because I actually that's like the one creepypasta I've never watched. And and that thing looks freaking creepy. It like has I need to find a Oh you're doing too much. This is dope. This is dope. I'm gonna have to play this later. I'm gonna make part ones and part twos. You're gonna increase the power of my YouTube burnout. I'm already making games. Why can't I like punch stuff in? Oh I can. <laughs> okay, enter. Okay. Okay. Five, five, five. Of course. Any drawings of Siren Head? Well, that's not creepy. Siren Head. Siren Head. I like how, like, in the other cabins, like, he, like, made it to where, or person, I don't know, made it to where, uh, you can interact with a lot of the objects. I mean, most games don't do that in every cabin either, but, like, you know, it's, it's a nice touch. It's a nice touch. So I don't know where that, what, where I'm gonna find, like, these numbers, but this game inspired me. And like, cause, cause like, the reason I like, uh, the reason why I usually don't put puzzles in my games, well, I mean I do, but I just don't consider this a puzzle, if that makes sense. So since I don't consider this a puzzle, this is the majority of what games consider puzzles. And I need to like, just get that in my head, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> So that way we could have some puzzles. Like I'm like I'm thinking of like Tomb Raider puzzles. Most games usually have these uh, point A to point B puzzles, which is fine, especially for like Slenderman games. Especially games like this, that's fine. Like it works, and it worked for um, PT also, which is one of the scariest things in the world. It's just like you know, so for, for whatever reason, I like being super creative with like every little thing. And thinking of a creative puzzle takes a lot of freaking energy. Like the Legend of Zelda stuff, that I, I, that's the kind of stuff I, like I'm going for. I mean, it's not you know, I mean, it's not super creative all the time, but you know, it's creative, it's innovative. There might be a better word for it, you know. And it's probably like just point A to point B puzzles in Legend of Zelda, but you know what I'm saying? Like I want mine to be like Sudico or whatever. That's, that's what I'm going for. So I have no idea where I'm gonna find, um, where I'm gonna find the, uh, the, the, you know. So we're gonna pause this. There might be a part two. Use my creations and you'll get your video on my uh, channel. Um, so that way you can find me finding my creations in your game. Thank you so much for making this. It was honestly, Honestly, this is like one of the best games I've played in Dreams. Like, like I'm, I've learned something from this game. Like, it's a 10 out of 10 for me. If in order for something to be a 10 out of 10 for me, I just have to learn something from it. That's all. That, that's that's about it. Yeah. If I, if I don't learn anything from it, then it's a seven out of 10. These are the rules. So yeah, I enjoyed this. I enjoyed this. I'm most likely always gonna find something to learn from something though.
Alright. Let me just walk over here. Siren head. Siren head. Alright. Peace.